They're asking me to factor out the greatest common factor. So GCF, greatest common factor. When I look at these two terms here, 1 and 2, I say, what can I divide out of both of them? Well, looking at the numbers, 15 and 10, what goes into 15 also goes into 10? 5. I'll be able to divide a 5 out of both of them. And when I look at the variables, in the first one I have x squared, 2x's, and in the second one I only have 1x. So how many x's can I take out of both of them? Can I take 2x's out of both of them? No, I can't. I could take 2x's out of the first one, but not the second one. There's only 1x there. So my greatest common factor when it comes to that variable is just 1x. That's the GCF. The greatest common factor is the GCF. Now when I factor it out, I have to write what's left over. Looking at the first term, what's left after I take out the 5x? 3x minus, and looking at the second term, what's left after I divide out the 5x? Just a 2, not an x, because that I've already taken that x out. All right, and you can always check this by multiplying it back out. If you FOIL this back out, you would get 15x squared minus 10x, right, which is what you started with. So your answer here is 5x on the outside and a 3x minus 2 left over on the inside. Here's what your answer can look like. Here's the greatest common factor of 5x, and then you have to write down what's left over after you factor that out. And that's factoring.